Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the world of me. My name's Cougar, and this is another episode from the Amazon Review Series. I have another package in today, and uh, oh, here we go, right here. See if we can focus in on that a little bit. And uh, if you can't quite read it, if you didn't already see the, uh, the video title, uh, this, of course, is another set of lights. Uh, these ones are for my bike. Let's go ahead and open it up, and we'll see what's inside. All right, so here we go. This is what was in the package. Uh, we've got this piece here, which is, uh, well, let's go ahead and open it up. Uh, there's a couple pieces, and they have it kind of separated out a little bit. But you've got an actual tail light right here, and then you've got the little clips. Uh, there is the charging port right there, and that is a USB-C charging port. You can see that there. Here is the little keeper uh, stretch rubber band that hooks over the end, goes around the bike tube, and then hooks over the back, and then it holds it in like that. So you've got a simple little light like that. That uh, You've got the little push button right here. And uh, with this thing closed, it is supposed to be uh, basically waterproof. So uh, if you're out riding when it's um, you know raining or anything like that, uh, you don't really have to worry about it, you know, screwing it up or anything. If we hit the button, we've got a few different uh, settings. And as you can see, there's the first one's constant on. The next one is constant on, but it's a little bit dimmer. we got another one that's flashing. Fast flashing, so hopefully consistent flashing fast. And then you're back to solid on. You just hold it and it turns off here is a little cord here and they do have it is pretty small right there as you can see but that is a, a USB-C cord well let me correct myself on that this is actually a USB uh, B micro uh, connector that this uses I was thinking it was a USB-C for some reason uh, but anyhow USB my B micro uh, just connect it plug it in charge up the little battery that's inside there Let's go ahead and get into the rest of it. Now, as you can see, it comes in a pretty decent, like, little box there. Multifunctional bicycle light, as it says. Uh, no real extra stuff there. Just basically the same thing over and over. Um, gives you some little disclaimer information. And uh, there we go and open it up. So here we've got the light here. And as you can see, it's... Uh, has a mount, and we'll go ahead and pull the mount out. And there we go, so it's got another charger. Uh, now, oh, here we go, that's why, is because this one actually uses the USB-C. So the tail light uses a USB-B micro, and this uses a USB-C. So uh, depending on which ones you already have, you may have both already. So you have extra cables that you can charge this with. Obviously, it can be charged off of pretty much anything. Um, battery bank, uh, laptop, off the computer directly, or of course, a simple wall plug. Here's the mount real quick. So as you can see, it's a nice long screw. Make sure that end stays on the screw head. And uh, then you can pivot it, and then that opens up. You've got uh, the rubber piece right here, which uh, goes, of course, around the handlebar. Uh, and then you've got the clasping section that kind of notches up into it to kind of keep it in place, it looks like. Uh, and then once you get on the handlebar, you snap this down and you screw it in and tighten it up until it's nice and tight on the system or on the handlebars. Uh, press this button here and that's going to be your little slide release. So we take this and just slide it on. There you may have heard the click. Try that again. There we go, and uh, it stays where it's at. Has a little bit of a little bit of wiggle room, not too bad. And then uh, you press it and move it back. Now the body on this is all aluminum, uh, so it is very robust. As you can see, there are multiple lights, and you can see there's kind of two sets. You've got two lights here with the kind of a diffuser, and then you have three lights across the top here that are just pretty much straightforward um, with the little uh, kind of almost magnifying type lens on the front that uh, most LEDs use. Uh, you can see it just has a simple 
kind of side markings here, just kind of for, I think, more decoration than anything. And then as you can see on top, it does have a digital uh, display as well as uh, you've got the light settings right there. So um, these, I think, each individually control the different lights. So I believe, uh, well, let's take a look. We'll press the bottom one. And as you can see, a fairly, fairly decent light. Uh, the bottom set has a, this is a bit of a, uh, now looking at it in camera versus what it looks like in real life, uh, it's much wider on camera. Uh, this has more of the, uh, well, not daylight setting. Oh, there we go. 67% battery life, it looks like. And it even shows which one's on. But uh, yeah, the color here is kind of that soft white-ish, uh, more like the standard, um, the standard light bulbs for say a car headlight. Uh, so we can hit that again, turn it off. Then we can hit the other one. The other one, as you can see, has it looks like it has a blue tint to it, um, and it does have a slight blue. But when you're uh, looking at it in real life, it ha it's it's much whiter than the, than this blue kind of coloring to it. So this is more of your. Uh, I don't know if this would be more of like your, I think this is maybe more of like a high beam. And then the other one is a low beam. And then what you can do is do both of them. And now you've got a lot of light. Um, as you can see, it is using up the electricity on it, the battery. But you've got a low beam and a high beam. You can even see the difference where you have a little bit of yellow here, a little bit of blue there. Very nice. They work very much just like a car, set of car headlights. Uh, oh, there we go. And you've got two different settings for this. I forgot about that. Um, or at least two. This is the low for those upper beams. And then you've got the strobe. And uh, hopefully you guys are okay from that. And then it's off. The lower one is just in on and off. So you can control them independently. And uh, it works really nice. Now, um, one other thing about this, too, is uh, obviously at the back, this is your little door for the USB. And you can, of course, plug in your USB-C connection there. But then you have the USB-A connector here. And like some of the other lights that I've reviewed in the past, if you haven't seen them, uh, this actually, when you charge it up, will also act as a battery bank. All right, everybody, we're outside. And uh, here we go. You can see there is the light on the back of the bike. I guess this is the low beam. This is the yellow one. And as you can see, there you can see the lights lit up. This is the, the lower beam. It's kind of pointed down a little bit. Lights up the area ahead of me pretty well. And uh, it has a little bit of a wide angle to it. And then Here's the high beam, as you can see, much brighter, a little more white. This has more of a blue tint to it uh, in uh, real life versus what it might look like here in the uh, video. And then this is, that's on high. This is what it looks like on low. And it's still pretty, pretty decent. As you can see, it's still lighting up a good area here lights up the signs and everything and then it's got the flash and back off and then if we light up both you can see very very bright if you guys want to check this out you can go down there in the description below there will be a link to this on the Amazon site as well as there will be of course all my social media down there uh, the PayPal link which takes place of patreon if you'd like to help out the channel and, uh, you know, don't forget, if you haven't done so already, hit that uh, subscribe button, hit that thumbs up button, ring that little bell down there so you know when you've got, when I've got new videos coming out here on World of Me. Uh, otherwise, I think that'll do it for me today, guys. Uh, again, my name's Cougar. This is The World of Me, another episode of the Amazon Review Series. I'd like to wish you all a good day, and I will see you later. Bye!